Yeah. So in your view, what combination of lifestyle habits, medical interventions, uh, and preventative care should we as individuals who want to age well focus on to maximize health span? I mean, you know, that, that is the kind of million dollar question, right? So if, if, we, if we really knew that, these longevity clinics, if they knew something we, we all don't know, um, you know, we would all be doing it. So, so I would say that as, as, as boring as it sounds, the advice is really what your mother told you, you know, eat, eat better, stay slim, you know, don't put on weight. Um, eat a balanced diet. You know, people can obviously go crazy and do, you know, high protein, no carbs. They can do Mediterranean, whatever they want. But, you know, a balanced diet that is not high in calories seems to be kind of a universal benefit. And we know obesity leads to all kinds of, you know, secondary effects and heart disease and so forth, right? More inflammation. So eat well, stay slim, get exercise. And, and we know the benefits of exercise on many, many diseases, right? So it seems, well, again, these are mostly associations, but people who exercise have lower incidence of a, of a wide variety of age-related disease, diseases. It seems to delay the onset. And, um, and yet you don't have to, you know, you don't have to be in the gym for an hour and a half every day. Even, even walking is really beneficial. So it seems that certainly kind of for moderate exercise, the um, more is better but some is way better than none. So you get a, you very quickly get a benefit by putting exercise into your daily routine or even other every other day routine compared to no exercise. 